Another very cute. Um, what's the name of this couch? Is by the way, accent couch, accent chair. I think. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. We were. welcome back to a new vlog how's everybody doing so i'm quite happy today because it's the beginning of a new vlog oh my god i feel so productive uh especially because i've just posted another vlog just now bro i'm so productive anyway um the agenda for today is i want to go and get my nails done finally bro i have been looking crusty for months for months now so let me go and get some let me go and get my nails done. I'm thinking of going short this time round. I don't want to do anything long. And I'm just going to do like a solid color. That should be easy and quick. Um, and yeah, I still have like some clothes to fold once I come back. But today is on a Sunday. I'm just chilling. I don't have a lot going on. So I thought, ah, let me just introduce the vlog. And then if anything comes, comes up, I'm going to show you. If not, we'll just continue the vlog. The next time i have something interesting to show you guys uh i'm also thinking of getting some wig lines and then i at least blow dry this week bye bye in the meantime before i get another one and yeah by the way i just realized that in the past three four vlogs i've not been telling you guys to subscribe i've not been reminding you guys to watch ads kindly please subscribe if you haven't what's the ads what's just one ad and if you're feeling philanthropic just watch two or three <laughs> So yeah, let's go and get our nails done. The next day. Soften up the mess. Drop it in the water. Let the daughter find an image with the rest. She'll be learning how to breathe. Spinning through identity. Reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie. You understand. Walk her down the valley, pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet. Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach, like the angels do. And you gon' make it through now. Tell about the healer, greater is the one within and call him as the leader. Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky. And I'ma wait up on the giver, he'll deliver like a dealer. To take her. Every door and how the windows let the sun in Copy out the key and tell her this is for becoming Even in the fever, baby, cry and get to running And tell her that you better get your bootstraps up You're with the army Ready when the truth act up, nothing can harm me Yelling from the roof I touch, put up a guard and count to ten Lion's den, speaking with the higher pen Can't be touched by fire then Fast forward to the grown things now I'm working on them soul things now Forgiving all your old ways But it's harder on the cold days Cold days Never been a product of a flawless environment Never acted like I'm higher than You, 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 you And I still pray Dear God, won't you send me a break Cause I, I need to get away, yeah
Your fire is consuming. Fill this place and set it up. You're the fire, you're the, fire. the refiner. The I wanna be consumed. Oh, I wanna be tried by fire. Yeah, yeah. Pure The next day. On this day, I was traveling to Embu. Uh, we had a function that I was attending, and I also wanted to see my family because it had been a while. So, enjoy the little montage of my travel journey, and yeah.
you can notice but i am not in nairobi anymore i'm in embo i mean in this restaurant that is called fanatic i haven't been here in such a long time actually i'm trying to hide my hair because it looks crazy so that's what's up I'm actually trying to connect to the internet this is literally the only hotel that i know that has internet connection so yeah i have ordered some food i'm with my brother and yeah we're actually waiting for our food that's what's up so baby the idea was hmm, i have a, a lot of things to catch you up on you guys i okay so first of all i ordered at this time that will be coming in um within this week but i'll not be around because i'm currently in Embu and i'll be staying here for like a week or so so that's what's up Ooh, i'm so excited actually i've really have been waiting for that tv stand for such a long time the people are literally looking at me but we don't care so i've been waiting for that tv stand for such a long time and i am so happy that it's going to come in so that's the first update the second update is that i'll be here in Embu for like three weeks three weeks no one week i mean so i'm really trying to like finish up with this vlog so that i can put it out so that at least i can still stay consistent so unfortunately i don't think you guys are going to see the tv stand in this vlog maybe on my next vlog so that's what's up we're still waiting for our food the day there is a swimming pool here i think you guys have already seen i wish i knew how to swim and in a field for more i wish i knew how to swim guys i cannot swim to save my life and it's so affordable it's actually 200 so people are just having fun swimming and i'm just sitting here envying them this is actually envy but yeah that's what's up actually let me wait for my food did i mention that i was with my brother Oh, the last place that you guys saw me shopping, I tried to thrift some clothes, but I only got her to recover. What else did I get at all? I think I'm, I don't know when I'm going to show you what I got, guys. Maybe on my next vlog. But yeah, I don't think there's anything else I want to update you on. Oh, okay. I remember the last time I talked to you guys, the last time I introduced this vlog, I had mentioned that I was going to get my nails done. Did I do that? No. <laughs> I'll explain that later. But yeah, that's what's up. Let's wait for our food and then we'll talk later. We'll catch up later. Guys, by the way, we ordered uh, chips masala, and that's how Zinaka baby Zinaka Mingi. If you thought I was disturbed before, baby girl, I'm gonna disturb you now. Imagine we don't have lights. Imagine we don't have lights. The way I was looking forward to coming home, just chilling, relaxing, catching up with some vlogs. Bro, we don't have lights. This is crazy. Oh my god, I feel so bad. Um, 
I passed through town. Actually, the initial plan was I wanted to get some, um, what are they called? Hot dogs. That is what I was craving. And then I came to the um, Nikapata Zimeisha. So I went to this place that they usually sell shawarmas for these things. I'm actually salivating right now because they usually taste so so good. Yeah, so this is what I want to have for dinner. I didn't have any energy. I don't have any energy to cook. And it's even better that we don't have lights. I'm not even going to feel more guilty. <laughs> so yeah, let me um, eat this. Take a shower, rest. Tomorrow I have a long long day. But I'm still going to continue the vlog because I have a few things that I need to catch you up on and then we just finish up with the vlog uh, so yeah the lights are back I think I spoke too soon <laughs> uh, but yeah oh my god I wanted to give you a review of this shawarma oh my god I don't know what they use to make this but these things taste so so good yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> hey you guys so it's the next day the last time we were talking was yesterday at night and i was complaining that we didn't have lights but zili rudy and i just slept i was so tired i'm still so tired today i feel like i've not rested well i literally am operating on um timeline of three hours i haven't slept because i remember i slept at um one and I woke up today at 6. I'm not used to waking up that early. But thank God I'm done with my errands. And I'm back home. So I want to finish up with this vlog. Because I feel like I have stretched it long enough. Um, initially the plan was I actually wanted to post it like uh, 4 days ago. But I felt like it was a bit short. It was only 16 minutes. And I usually like my vlogs to be a bit longer. Uh, so I decided I'll just wait until I come back to Nairobi. And then of course I'll have things to vlog. And here we are. But I'm going to finish up with the vlog today so the agenda for today is i want to do a haul of a few things that i got from embo they're not actually a lot i think i have shown unique thrift so that's the agenda for today and then the next clip that you guys are going to watch are clips from me surprising my mom for her birthday oh my god i've been wanting to surprise her for such a long time usually see people surprising their parents like buying them land buying them like big big things buying cars and i've always wanted to do like something nice for my mom i feel like if like literally i had the money i would literally buy her the whole world but for now it's okay we'll just use what we have so it was her birthday and i wanted to buy her a tv we do have a tv at home but in Arabica. so i decided instead of taking it kwa fundi and it's actually a bit old school uh let me just buy her something nice you know so i got her a 32 inch um yeah it's just my mom and my brother so there was no need of like buying a big tv my brother is actually uh never at home he has his own place so it's technically just my mom so i felt like just buying a 32 inch would be enough for her and that's what i did um so yeah so the next few clips that you guys are going to watch are um just me showing you where i got the tv and the amount in case maybe you want to surprise your mom you never know or you want to just buy for your loved one you'll know the price and i don't know maybe it will motivate you to do something for your loved ones <laughs> um so yeah uh but first let me do the haul it's not actually a lot of things i think i've already mentioned and then and then the next clips that you guys are going to watch are me surprising her so yeah let me set you up let me set you up let me set you up and then i show you what i got so the first thing that i got is a bodysuit a white bodysuit i have always wanted to own a bodysuit a white bodysuit i mean i have so many bodysuits and for some weird reason i've never gotten a white one so when i got it uh when i was thrifting it was like yeah i'm taking you home baby <laughs> and this is how it looks like it's actually from zara as you can see pretty basic pretty cute basic like i said so the thing that I actually loved the most when I was thrifting is this scarf that looks like this. Oh my god, I love these scarves so so much. I think it's Fendi. Oh my god, I don't know which brand this is. I think I'll write it on the screen once I do my research. But I know there's a specific brand that looks exactly like this. It's just a scarf. And this scarf was so affordable. It was going for 200 pop. 200 pop and it was like 200 for such a scarf, I feel like that was such a steal. 
looks like this it's so cute oh my god i love it and i love the fact that it has like uh different prints um so you can interchange it the way you want absolutely love it this was the star of the show honestly oh i actually also bought some shoes and i forgot them at home yeah i'm very sad <laughs> Um, the other things I got are some pair of socks that look like this. Basic, basic, basic stuff. <laughs> now, another thing that I absolutely loved. Another thing that I absolutely loved was this duvet. Duvet cover. Let me actually interchange it. When I got home yesterday, I tried to fit it. So, I didn't even... Anyway, just give me a minute, you guys. I'm thinking of actually arranging it with you. I actually love the prints. I do have a white duvet cover, and that duvet cover, honestly, in any kind of stress. I'm not going to lie, you guys. It's actually very nice when you're using white things until it's time to clean. Yeah, and then place in Yenaishi because it's Karibu na Barabara, there is a lot of dust that is coming in. So, Nikitumia do duvet cover a white. Yeah, it's not working in my favor. And one thing about me, I will not choose to struggle. So, I bought a darker duvet cover that looks like this. Absolutely love the prints. Absolutely love the prints. It was actually the prints that made me take it and then i think you can interchange it as well so this side and this other side um i had actually <laughs> i had forgotten i also got a key holder so cute oh my god i love it i'm always losing my keys and i feel like with this key holder <laughs> uh it will be a bit hard to, to lose my keys now I'll, i'm always misplacing my keys i'm thinking for like when trust i'm going to find like um what are they called key holders key hangers yeah just right where my door is so that every time i get in i can hang my keys and that way i will not lose them so cute i love it so um yeah you guys that's everything that i got from emu it was not a lot of things like i said but i still wanted to show you because um why not so yeah the next clips that you guys are going to watch are like me buying my mom the tv and i guess that's it um yeah oh let's go and arrange my baby cover my bed i need i need to change the bed sheet as well i haven't been at home for one week of course, a whole week kamai jatumiwa, it's dusty. So we need to do something about that. And then, yeah, let's do that. By the way, guys, don't be fooled. I know this bed looks like it's thin. It's actually clean, but it's dusty. And that is the problem. <laughs> that is the problem. Soften up the mess. Drop it in the water, let the daughter find an image with the rest She'll be learning how to breathe Spinning through identity, reveal another pretty little scheme Save her mind Hold her hand And don't believe a lie, you understand me Walk her down the valley Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach Like the angels do And you gon' make it through now Tell about the healer Greater is the one within and call him as the leader Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky And I'ma wait up on the giver He'll deliver like a dealer to take her Show her every door and how the windows let the sun in 
copy out the key and tell her this is for becoming even in the fever baby cry and get to running and tell her that you better get your bootstraps up you're with the army ready when the truth act up nothing can harm me yelling from the roof i touch put up a guard and count to ten lion's den speaking with the higher pen can't be touched by fire then. fast forward to the grown things now so guys that's how the bed turned out i feel like it looks different and now this duvet cover will be manageable at least so yeah so this is the place where we got the tv from we specifically or rather i wanted to get the tv specifically from um a supermarket because i felt like it was more safe that way in terms of warranty and in case the tv was at fault we could easily return it without having a lot of conflict so i wanted to get the tv from uh, the supermarket even though it meant that it would be a bit higher compared to getting it from other shops but i was still okay with it that's the first thing the second thing is that i wanted to get her the same brand as mine simply because the brand that i am um, the brand that i have royal royal i don't know how to pronounce it uh, i have been totally okay with it it has not given me any problems and it's also affordable compared to other brands so that's what i wanted to get and yeah oh. So guys we've come to the end of the vlog i hope you enjoyed watching please um give the video a like subscribe if you haven't and i will catch you on my next vlog which will be my tv stand ah, my tv stand vlog i am so excited for you guys to see that so please stay tuned um uh, and yeah bye